Neighbors and friends say Eddie Bell did her best with Johnny, but Johnny needed more than a mother's love and protection. He it was August 1991, and our cameras were there as Eddie Bell's body was carried out of her house, murdered by her 16-year-old son, Johnny. Six o'clock that morning, uh, I heard an argument. Lynette Grace was staying at the Bell home that night because Johnny's mom was the mother Lynette felt she never had. Um, I went to the basement and found uh, my spiritual mother, Mrs. Bell, uh, bleeding uh, on the on the basement floor. Then 16-year-old Johnny killed his mother in a rage and turned the knife on Lynette. Um, stabbed me in the face first and my glasses came off. Then he stabbed me in the chest um, by, by my heart and then in my leg and my shoulder area. Lynette escaped and Johnny was tried as an adult and sent to prison for life. This is Johnny Bell 31 years later, the head of Marion Correctional Center Wildlife and Bird Center. When I received the letter, I was scared to death. That letter came in 2011 from Lynette Grace who wanted to visit Johnny in prison and find closure. I felt as though I couldn't do less for him than what God had done for me by allowing me to make it out of the house alive. And so. when Johnny asked for forgiveness. I'll forgive you without hesitation. She said, I must forgive because if I don't, I'm gonna be held accountable. Lynette's belief in forgiveness drives her. You would have thought I was the one that had committed a crime with a crime of forgiveness. Lobbying lawmakers, judges, prosecutors, and the parole board for Johnny's release. All kids aren't, you know, born bad, and who doesn't deserve a second chance? My mom's not living no more. I feel he shouldn't be living no more. The words of Johnny's older brother 31 years ago. Forgiveness from all of his family hasn't come yet, but Lynette's grace. To give forgiveness a chance. Has allowed him to forgive himself. Someone giving someone the power of forgiveness is like releasing them from guilt or being free. Forgiveness, Lynette insists, is not a crime. But in the time that she's been in my life, everything that's been impossible has been made possible. Are you free now, even though you're in here? I am.